<laughs> this one's gonna be fun. Uh, good news is, actually, I've already done better on this bridge. When I did this design in the challenge mode, I did a design that was $16,000 cheaper. So, this will be very good. Top 51% for now, but... How did this go again? I may have to revisit. No, this was it. This was it. This was at least close to it. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. A working design. Uh, not quite 16... Or it was 16k cheaper. It's under 20k. But it's not even close to the top. So many people got cheaper stuff. Good news is, we can probably shave money on this. Let's see if I can get rid of this yet. I would just have to have this be more stretched. Just with the decent rotation point. What I'm worried about is two things. One, why the fuck does that not hit? And two, can I get the dump truck to not destroy this? Come on! I can't stretch this much further. I will die. This will destroy it. RIP! So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna load up budget. And then, I'm gonna go to normal roads. And we'll see if this supports the truck. It may not, but it also may. Damn. Tried. What if I have just reinforced roads here, and then the center is normal, because the center is supported by a fuck ton of steel. Really? So unfortunately, that didn't work out. Let's try other ideas. We don't have wood. Wait, can I do a spring here, possibly? Springs in the middle, they're just compressed. Like this. And then, hold on. And then steal stuff on the side. Could work. Maybe it doesn't need to be this heavily compressed, but springs are cheaper than steel. Oh. Maybe if I replace the other steel with springs, we got something going good too. Top 16%. We're not even close though. What is this bridge? It's a glorious design. It's a spring masterpiece. Do I even need those steels at all? Okay, we're not getting anywhere near this. I feel like I have to redesign. Can I do this ever? Bring this up a bit more. Go up! Why is it so slow? That's a shame. Let's try 40% and let's stretch this more. Just 40% across the board. 40% stretch, 40% compressed. So far, so good. Ooh. Ooh, okay, that's a good budget shave. We're not even top 10%. What the fuck? Did everyone just do dangling road for this and I'm just too slow to figure it out? All right, let's, let's... That can't possibly be it, though. What if I get rid of these? Oh! Optional? The steel is definitely optional. Look at this budget. Wouldn't it be glorious if we got that? This is unfortunate. Um, I wish I could just do a single spring here too, but it's too short. What I really would like to do is have these just be regular roads. Maybe this works now, who knows? But honestly, the dump truck's just gonna destroy them and ruin my day. Like, watch this shit. <gasps> but if it doesn't break, I'll be so happy. Wait. Oh, I have never been more happy. It was so close. Let's try uh, one of these in the middle. I was so happy to be wrong! And then I was proved wrong again. Interesting. <gasps> Two fortified roads gets me there. T t t You've gotta be fucking joking. What is everyone doing? I cannot believe how much progress needs to be made. And <laughs> just make more accounts that have a high budget. You know, we can use Twitch chat for that. Everyone who hasn't played this level yet, please just load it up and get like a $50,000 solution and just run it. New idea. We're gonna do maximum length spring and then we're gonna bring the road to the spring. And then we're gonna just have the uh, spring expand up so it basically covers the height necessary. What actually does suck is now this doesn't reach. I was afraid of this. One spring in the center. Ah, uh, just the new idea, you know, more springs. It looks like it kind of supports decently. Looks like it could be cheaper too, so I'm gonna run with it. Hope for the best. Yeah, as long as this little gap isn't an issue, I mean, there's potential here. Oh, shit! 
Whoa! How did the fuck did nothing break? There was not a single reinforced road. Get me the hell out of this level! Okay, talk about a jump. How the fuck nothing broke is insane to me, but we did get it. Maybe just the fact that everything was a spring made it really nice. We're not even that far off the number one. God, we have come such a long way since the first time I did this bridge. Five times cheaper, probably same joint stress in all honesty. Very cool. On to the next one. Shafted. Great. Just, this is a normal bridge after everything else that's happened. A lot has changed. Good news is the most stress is just on our wood supports in the bottom, which can become a muscle and easily taken care of. Top 14%, not a bad start. So here's what I want to try. I want to just try normal roads. Let's run this, see how this holds up. If it fails, then, well, we can just do better supports on the sides. It was a road that broke. That's a shame. So let's try to even get rid of one, one fortified road with this. Just, just one. All right, good start. Ah, less of a good start. Right, didn't I say I was going to do this? Muscle here. You know this was gonna be good. Like once it breaks the halfway point, it's usually fine, but there we go. I don't even know this is my new best. I don't think it, no, it's not. So I need to shave off more roads. So something like this and then that. Okay. So if I get rid of a few fortified roads, that's a step in the right direction. Top 13%. Top 8%, it's quite nice. I think I either need one, a higher arch, or two, I just need to commit to a flat design. Yeah, we're, we're back to where we began. The price is actually not even that much more expensive. We have muscles on the top. It does work though. Unfortunately, I don't think we're that much higher up. Not even uh, top 500. I wonder if I could do too long muscles going to this part? But first, let me try to just drag this down and see if we can do this instead. Maybe? Well, that's a good budget shop. So that's not a good stress. Top 4%? Getting there. Can I ever bring this up then? So this arch is a little better? It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> Under 18k? We're not even close. This was my best budget. We're at 17 and a half thousand. So it barely gets across. I can use, you can see there's obvious muscles and stuff, but it's only top 3%. What I'm instead going to do is watch the stress on this and use this to decide what could maybe be better. So this triangle hardly goes under stress, but the thing is if I get rid of any one of them, I'm kind of screwed. That's how we cheap out. I knew there was some way we could make that cheaper. I just clearly wasn't seeing it. That's the one that's useless. I'm like, there's so much green stuff there. There's gotta be something I could do. I'm sure it could be done on this side as well. Okay, good. Progress today. It feels good to at least make some progress. We still got a lot to shave before we make it to top 1%, but we got rid of two whole pieces of wood and now we're to top 2%. So I guess that's that's a good start. I could try the cheaper right side again. Flip it. It is just bizarre to me how this goes to shit, and I guess it doesn't on the other side. Maybe the only reason the other side could get away with being so bad was because this side just did all the heavy lifting. This truck moves slower on the left side? Hmm. So it spends longer on here, so this side has to be more load-bearing. Maybe this side does not need to be that heavy, heavily load-bearing then. Maybe we could just do a double muscle here and that's good enough. Oh, I think there's a little bit of merit to that. It's crazy though, the longer the, um, the longer the car or truck or whatever spends on the bridge, the more likely it is to break. Yeah, we can technically weaken the bridge as we go, so maybe even over here I could do a similar idea. Unfortunately, this is just, well, hold on, now we try road. Because I was talking about how road is stronger, just heavier, before. See, that was actually better. Uh, it, only by a little bit. Like, a tiny bit, but that was technically better. Reinforced roads are mega expensive. But they're also not terrible. It's also... It's, wait, is this my cheapest? 16.8. Oh, nice, it is my best. 
casually reinforced road. So hold on. I so badly would want to just have a regular road here. If there's... Maybe if I make some small adjustments to get this to just be a regular road, we could be happy. Oh! Hold up. Double road. <gasps> the double road! <laughs> this is so stupid. You know, maybe we'll get there with road today. Who knows? Just road under supports. We're at 99.9% .9 stress. You want know chat? We're gonna try the road muscle. We're gonna attempt a road muscle in this area with a wood in the middle, because that's usually how it goes. <laughs> I was thinking about it. The second I replaced roads here, I'm like, well, I guess this is in the right direction. Yes! Not a bad bridge at all. It just has road where it's not even tr being driven over. It's just as support. Next, 311. Oh, wait, cross jump, huh? Is this really? No, we had a budget here. We go for breaking here because I remember I got top five in this one. Or was it top three? I don't remember. We spent hardly any money. So a working design here should mean we won't have to do too much. Oh, but we're out of the top 1%. Okay, I stand corrected. People passed me up. Well, in that case, let's get to work, huh? Things to change. It's obviously got to be this ramp. This ramp is dog shit. Can I get away with this? Or is this going to break? <gasps> I can get away with that. That is an excellent thing to start. We may have to convert to roads for supports if this doesn't get me there. It gets me close, actually. And before I even bother, I can always do the classic make shit shorter. Where I make shit shorter and save money that way. Um, Losing that speed isn't good, though. If I raise this up... How does this do? Uh, it sticks the landing, kind of, but it does lose a little speed in the process. Honestly, we could probably get there just by doing minor changes like this. As much as I want to just do some crazy stuff, if we don't have to, I won't bother. Because I'm even okay with the break there. That's fine. We already break elsewhere. Yeah, we're within two spots. Let's, let's push it back even a little bit more. Actually, him hitting the ramp and breaking it helped his landing. You'll love to see that sort of teamwork, and you'll love to see a top 1%. Really, without too many changes. Yeah, I'm not in the mood to really tweak through too much of this stuff. I'll settle for a measly top 1%. So let's carry on.